Super Weekly here, and today, I just, oh, I just got paid. <laughs> awesome. Well, today, I'm going to be going over my new roleplay server on multi theft Auto San Andreas. Alright, now with that being done said, let's go ahead and get straight into the intro so I can, you know, explain all the goody goodies about this shit. Okay, so first things first, in this server, you are going to have custom police departments as well. So the department I'm standing in right now is going to be one of our sheriff departments. It is going to be for the Pasco County Sheriff's Office, okay? Which would actually kind of be for the SFPD. If you haven't seen the SFPD, it's kind of basic. You know, you got your cells that are going to be down here. I'm gonna run down here real quick, but you kinda got your cells and you got your upstairs for the uh, administration staff, you have your chief's office, you have your briefing. But um hey, you got your chief's office as well as your commander and some administration over here. <coughs> Same thing up here. And if you run down over here oh, not in this room. What the hell am I doing? Okay. <laughs> you wanna hear it? Uh, some offices, I guess, for like the FTLs or whatever the training. You're gonna have your training room, and you got your briefing. All right, so that's just gonna be the Pasco County Sheriff's Office Police Department. All right, and as well as the Florida High Patrol, this also have their custom department as well. So now that was the inside of it. Let's go ahead and take a look at the outside. Oh, and we do have a business system set up, and I'll get to that later. But, of course, you're going to have your cars as well. You're going to have a normal patrol cars as well as your supervisor, <coughs> which is apparently on. I don't know why. But let's say all those cars are gone. Same thing with the supervisor. Oh, no, what do you do? Well, you just want to hit your little nice F1 key up here, and it'll bring your F1 menu up. I already got mine set up. So, you can change the skin to whatever you want, as well, you can give yourself weapons, and I do have custom weapon sounds, and you have your create vehicle, you have the three departments, Florida High Patrol, Pasco Sheriff's Office, and Tampa Police Department, I'll get into that later, but also if you want to join the server, I'll leave the interview server down in the description below, as well as the application you're going to need to date. Alright, so... Let's go to the transfer over to our FHP Troop A headquarters. Now it's a custom. I pretty much went in the map out of there and I added it. But you're gonna have your big parking lot right across over there, as well as your tiny parking lot. And you got your watchtower with sniper rifle on top, because you know why not. <laughs> and let's hop right inside. So upon entering, you got your FHP headquarters. Alright, nothing too special. You got your cells back here. You know. Yeah. <laughs> and really nothing too special. But these are, you're going to have a bunch of interiors. Ranging from police departments to restaurants to barbershops, tattoo parlors, so and so forth. A bunch of other things. So, yeah. That's, that's the interior script. Moving on to the another one. Alright, so the next script that I'm going to be demonstrating is you're going to have a custom ELS system, okay? Um, so, to activate your lights, all you got to do is press T on the keyboard, type slash ELM space 1 to activate your lights. And that will activate your emergency lighting system. That's what we have right now. Um... Not the best, but you know, it'll do it for roleplay wise. Okay. So, but yeah, you're gonna have your custom emergency lighting system. And by the way, this is my department that I'm in charge of, the Tampa Police Department. So, if you ever join a server and you want to join Tampa Police Department, feel free because I'm, I'm hiring. 
<laughs> All right, so let's go to the next one. The next script I'm going to be showcasing is a custom business system. All right. <clears throat> so let's say you're a civilian and you want to make your own business within the game. Well, in FSRP, you can. All you need to do is type slash business, B U S I N, oh shit, slash business, and you'll be brought up to this. All right. So. All you need to do is click here to pick up your player's coordinates. All right, and for the business name, it's going to put it type. Uh, it's going to put test. Now for the business cost, what I'm going to be doing since I only have 200 that much, going to put it that much because when you create your business, it's going to create it, but the owner is going to, but for the owner, it's going to say for sale. So. Depending on how much you want the business to be, how much you want the business to cost, when you create it is depending on how much money you're gonna have your in your account. So I'm gonna go do that. Now the business payout, it's gonna do one dollar. Every one second, nah, <laughs> I ain't gonna do that. So one dollar every one minute. All right, seems fair enough. Now it's gonna ask you, you want to create it. Yep, we're gonna create it. And ta-da! You have created your business. Name test. Now once you walk in it, just press N. It's gonna say owner for sale, and I'm gonna buy it. It's gonna ask you to buy it and look. Oh. Never mind. But I forgot about that. If you already have three businesses, you cannot have any more. The maximum limit for businesses is gonna be three. So you can create as you can create as many businesses as you want, but you cannot buy the business you create if you already have three created and you own them. That's how the business script work. All right, now if you're an admin and you see a business that that you don't want being there, you can easily go in there and you can do stuttering. If you're an administrator within the server, what you can easily do is you can easily go to any business, or if you just press F11. Oh. Um, if you press F11, oh, come on, wait, okay, that ain't gonna move. Anyway, so you're gonna see all the businesses labeled all over the map. They're gonna be marked with money signs. All right, uh, if you, uh, you, as an administrator, of course, I'm gonna go around, I'm gonna go take a look at all the businesses. But let's say this is a business that I don't want to be there. Since I'm an admin with any server, what I can easily do is I'm gonna walk up to the business, press in to open it, and I can destroy the business. This is no longer going to be there. All right. But that is the business system for FSRP. All right. The next trip I'm going to be showcasing is your cruise control. Let's say you're traveling down the highway, blah, 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 that, and you want to text on your phone. Keep in mind, kids, don't text and drive. It's not safe. But let's say you're driving down the road and you want to uh, press T. Once you let go of the gas, oh no, you stop. You can't drive. Or there's a solution. You get to, get to the speed that you want to go to, press C. Alright, I'm going to set the controller down. Set it down. Now I can just go ahead and type whatever I want. To stop it, you're going to press C again because uh, <laughs> i got to slow down. But that's pretty much it. All you gotta do is press C to set your cruise control, and you can go possibly anywhere. So, moving on to the next script. Let's say you're a pyrotechnic, and I think I pronounced that wrong. Oh well, let's move on. <laughs> let's say you're a pyrotechnic. Uh, this sounds so jank, but let's say you like playing with fire or you like creating fire. Well, we have a script that you can just do that simple thing. Okay, all you gotta do is press T on the keyboard, type slash fire to bring up the GUI. All right, yes, we have a GUI. All you need to do is press this button to get your current player's location. You might want to move the hell out of the way because it's 
Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'll just go ahead and set the fire size. Alright, let's go ahead and set it to 100. Now all I gotta do is set it to 100 and voila! We got a fire. Just for your fire department. and smooth so yellow okay let's not walk into that but anyway I'm gonna move on I don't feel like getting caught up into that fire I'm let the fire department handle that yeah okay anyway next script okay so our last and final script is we got first person. All you need to do, press T, type slash, put FP, hit enter, and voila, you go into your uh, first person mode. So, this is first person. Alright, you can drive around, so on and so forth. I think my lights, let me go to turn my lights on. Oh, okay, that just um, happened. Oh. That's first person. I, uh, now, it's great for driving, but let me just show you something. Okay, well, the aiming is a little bit off. <laughs> okay. Oh, aiming's a bit off. So, but, oh well. But yeah, that is your first person script. I do plan on getting a new one. Or finding a new one, if not making a new one. Which, we all know that ain't gonna happen, but um... That's your first person script. Ain't the best. It'll work. You know, good for driving. If you like driving in first person, but it's not good for uh, shooting. Will not work. We, uh, we all seen that, so... But um... If you like the server, and you want to join, I'll have a server link for our interview server down in the description below. Alright, the requirement, requirement is you must have MTA installed as well as you must have a working mic and you must be above the age of 15 years or older. Alright, if you're not above the age of 15 years or older and you try doing the application and we find out that you're lying, you're going to be denied. Alright. And you will not, and you will not be allowed to retake another application until you hit the age requirement that we request. All right. Um, we are looking for active members. All right. And if you want to get into a good MTA SA or RP community, well, we're open and we're available anytime. So anyway. And about SAPDFR Online, yes, I will still be playing SAPDFR Online. I've just been busy with the server lately, getting everything set up and getting it up and working properly and functioning right. But um, pretty soon, I'll say here, maybe tomorrow, I will record an uh, SAPDFR Online video and post it for you guys. But yeah, just make sure you guys stay tuned. But other than that, this is Trooper Weekly, and I'm out. Peace. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go.